All right, guys, so we're starting off this vlog with me walking in a motherfucking alley because my car decided to have a misfire and have the catalíticos clogged up. <laughs> it happened to me during lunch, and I was on my way home. Thankfully, I was able to make it home and park it outside, and I was just called one of the coworkers to come pick me up so I can continue working. But right now, I just clocked out for the day. I'm on my way home. I found somebody to let me borrow their car. I'm a bus the mission all the way to San Bernardino. I'm gonna get a Catalitico O2 sensor and I don't know what else. Then I gotta stop at AutoZone, get some spark plugs, and we fixing the damn car tonight. In one shot. Hopefully it clears all the fucking check engine and all the other little bullshit. And don't mind the heavy breathing. I am power walking in jeans. You know, I am fucking dying right now. Everybody who knows me knows I stay wearing shorts because my balls can't breathe. Anyways, it's probably like another 10, 15 minute walk from here. Shouldn't be that bad. Alright, so Primo Teriyaki, let me borrow this fucking truck. Sorry if you can't hear me that well. Uh, I didn't close the window and apparently it doesn't close on this side. And now the radio's on. But yeah, anyways. Let's bring most area. I can let me borrow a stroke real quick so I can come and pick up the catalítico and the little engine cover that I need. Um, but yeah, we should be there in about 40 minutes. That clock is wrong. It's 9.30. But yeah, we got to be back by 11 because that's what time he closes up and is trying to go home, which I completely understand. If everything goes to plan, I should be there like 11.15, 11.25. And when I mean 11, 15, 11, 25, I mean back home, like back at Primo's Teriyaki. All right, so I just pulled up and all the cops are in the back. I already got the fucking pieces and I'm out of here. Gone. All right, so we made it back to Primo's Teriyaki. Mosh is right there on the floor. Yeah, right there on the floor. My fool's right there waiting for me and my boys. We can start on this shit. Okay, I've been yawning a lot. Now I'd put on the flash, but my battery's dying. <laughs> Anyways, it's midnight and we about to steal this catalítico off this act. Oh wait, no, it's my actor. We're about to replace the catalítico and spark plugs. See if that fixes the issue. Now our fat asses couldn't wait, so we fucking gobbled down the primo teriyaki because, let's be honest, it was bomb. I was hungry and that fool hadn't ate all day. So, uh, yeah, we fucked it up first, and now we're doing this. Just take me so it's officially for like 5 o'clock in the morning. No, I'm fine. Yeah. <laughs> okay. within the old ones. Well, that's my old one. That's the new old one. But... Yeah, hopefully this helps out a lot. And if not, we're still gonna keep the other one, so I ain't tripping. Sick ass vato. No, like, I just need to tick a little bit, but. I mean, bolts are stuck and shit, and he's a torch and whatnot, and it's fucking 1 o'clock in the morning, so we're not trying to make too much noise. And after this, we just gotta do the spark plugs, and that's it. So then I just gotta get my ignition coils. Just in, you can get all, all, all four, three, all four, four. Yeah, I'm gonna do all four. If you want, but... Yeah, I'm gonna do all four regardless, because we're gonna put brand new spark plugs and yeah. shit. Yeah. So, but well. you saw this one, too. Look at this shit. The cops already passed by once and didn't say nothing. So I... I guess we're cool, even though it's 2 o'clock in the morning. Alright guys, so it's the next day and we already cleared the the code for the cats. Um, I also put the spark plug, well, the homie put the spark plugs in all that shit. We just gotta do the ignition code to get that shit from stop blinking and to go away. And I already got them. I just gotta install them in my lunchtime. Because I am at work right now. Supposedly. Not even gonna lie, it's kinda hot, there's no shade, but let's get this shit done and over with. 
All right, so I already took off the cover. Just gotta take off the 10 millimeter socket, pull this shit out, unplug it, put the new one in. Repeat the process four times, put the fucking cover back on, check engine light should be gone. This is so you guys can see the old versus the new. I'm on the last one, I just gotta put the cover back on and we should be straight. All right, so moment of truth. It's running fucking smooth, doesn't feel weird, doesn't sound weird. I just gotta get that fucking shit cleared and we should be good. Final result, no check engine light. Yes sir.